Hello friends, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Uh, and today we are going to start uh, the new playlist uh, of the video tutorial that is on the Zukin software or you can say uh, E3 cables, E3 form boards, E3 schematics, uh, E3 database editors. So this software is called as and uh, this software the, uh, is only used for uh, lots of wire harness work just like uh, in automotive industry for making foam boards this software is basically used for making one to one uh, one to one dimension uh, wires or diagrams okay so today I will only cover the what the purpose of the software and uh, where it is used and how this will be helpful to your skills ok so uh, this software is basically uh, used in automotive industry for wire harnesses secondly it is used uh, some mechanical uh, fluid type works and this is also used for the schematic for making electrical schematic work and then it is used for the what you can say making the logic diagrams ok so jo, so let's get started with this here in this interface you can see here uh, this here is the ribbon ok in these different commands are highlighted by using different different symbol ok and uh, then at the right side of this window here is the component here is the symbol here is the miscellaneous ok so if you, if you see on the component by default you can have these libraries just like ABB disconnector accessories this air conditioning in different uh, cables connectors uh, which are used in automotive industry which are used in various electrical machines connectors terminals uh, tapes or what we can say different uh, components uh, are saved here this is called as database ok here the component is there and uh, before component the symbol is required right for representing that object first of all symbol is created then we make the component and in miscellaneous uh, different these hoses are there right some cables are here bundles here this shield shield table some twist heads ok like this so in this video tutorial I am going to make the playlist on how to use the software different different commands how to make the home boards how to create connectors and then how to create symbol how to create the components how to create the cable how to create the wires then how to create different terminal different types of terminal in Zukin how to create the connector in Zukin and then how to create uh, just like uh, here is the content just like yeah here these are the connector how to create the connectors here and after creating this connector how to use on the drawing ok so and next uh, what the things yeah this fuses how to make this fuses in Zukin or how to use in the on the form board or on drawing ok form board uh, one question is arising in your, in your mind that is form board so what is the form board form board it's uh, one type of board and here the assembly of the wire harness uh, is held just like uh, different connect uh, as you know in harness how many parts are there connector terminal uh, seals wedge locks and uh, cable bundles tapes for tree uh, then uh, cable ties 
different different uh, by using different these parts the harness is made conduits are conduits are also there breading is there right so this representation we have to show on the form board and uh, this assembly is held on the board that is called as form board for wire harness manufacturing okay so this drawing is basically used in industry for manufacturing or assembling the different wire harnesses cabling harnesses of automotive defense sector aerospace sector in this industries okay so this skill definitely help you in your job skills okay so just subscribe the uh, youtube channel if you you are new on this channel because only on my channel you will get some unique videos related to design skills already i had made uh, the videos on pure parametric wire harness part modeling sheet metal development and uh, some assembling work and then 3d routing work okay so you can visit my channel for there right uh, so this is just a introduction video so i already tell about tell you about uh, about this, all the features of this opera okay and what the content we are going to learn in this uh, playlist and next uh, i today in this here you can see this is the new file if you click on here is the new file just click on the new file then uh, here yeah this sheet is created this is the first sheet first number and next uh, i would like to just click on tick mark tick mark this here here by default this drawing is open here okay now we are in the schematic uh, mode so again uh, you just right click here click on new sheet here in this window you can type your drawing name just like x y z drawing number uh, then uh, here location okay here in this format uh, here is the you have to select the sheet size different sheet sizes available here and you can create your own sheet size and uh, i will also cover how to create different types of template and different types of tables connected tables in this uh, playlist video okay so uh, here i will select okay anyone i can select here by default this is a uh, selected of the uh, dina1 this size sheet size or here yeah, different sheet size are there you can take anyone if you select this here preview of that template is also showing here okay and here in the type this this was on schematic you have to click on the form board okay and now uh, yeah okay just click on okay in the second sheet here you can see okay actually this sheet is not proper let it be i disactivate this first one and here right click and go to sheet property we can change the sheet format from here just like i would like to take uh, this one apply we'll see how this is okay this is also different not looking good we'll try to change the template here and next uh, i will take which one will be okay okay we'll try one by one okay yeah this is just looking little good then click on okay right now here this is the sheet here over here and now i want to yeah here we have to in click on component and then just click on the uh connector where is the connector actually yeah here is the connector okay if you not found the connector here is search command is i have added already already here if uh, how to add this component name this search criteria here i will show you in the upcoming videos so here after clicking on this connector different components are or different connectors are there just click on this uh, connector uh, hold right click by mouse and drag this to on this form board this will just little getting a load okay 
different different views of that connector i can see here click on this this is the side view this is the insertion view and this is the other view okay so i would like to take this side view and click on place and here this is the table now after uh, placing so this table is uh, we have to position anywhere on this form board i am going to place okay i will place here this uh, connector actually having how many pins this 18 pin this connector have here is the single uh, signal here is the cable and the conductor and target okay and now here this connector we have placed here in form board and next uh, for connecting this uh, we always use mostly the shortcut key c press c on your keyboard and then here this point is highlighted select this point and connection started click here here you can see okay here you can see this uh, connector uh, started the connection here okay so this is just i am showing the simple sample how to place the connector in the form board okay here this wire is uh, connection is created or you can say right click over here different options are available here okay i will move this table to this side and next i will take the next connector drag and drop here okay then i would like to yeah actually yeah in this uh, i i want that uh, which yeah i want this top yeah we can take this uh, top view also click on place and then click here okay now uh, just again press the c shortcut key on your keyboard like this take this connection uh, click on your shift key hold shift key and yeah zoom this much part by press controlling controlling press and then here you can see this point is highlighted okay this point gray color we have to select that one now this connector is connected okay like this right so this is just sample i have just shown you i placed this two connector in the form board and next uh, i co connected the both the connector and i will take one of the wire for routing purpose so here in this we have to i am going to take this txl uh, this is uh, by default awg16 bn means brown uh, we can change from here which uh, wire which type of wire is there which color is there just like um, um, if we have this uh, what you can say red 18 gauge red color wire so select this one and this is the type of the wire TXL ok we can take different types of wire uh, types are there and then here is the command insert default wire click on this then I will simply click on this first table which is highlighted first row and next select the first row of the second table here you can see this wire is routed here this is the signal first signal and conductor 1 and target is x2 ok this is x1 here you can see and this is the x2 ok and now uh, these connections are showing by red dot dotted line it means the length is not fixed yet click on this connection press the shift key select this one also and then uh, right click here and uh, here, here somewhere there will be a connection properties Mm, where is the connection here is the correction property and here uh, actually where yeah here manufacturing length so i am going to put i uh, will put a 10 or i will put the 5 5 over here here also put the 5 inches click on uh, tick this in the box click on ok ok now ok here you can see both the wires what you can say both the wires are lengths are defined okay and now here you can see i just click on this uh, segment of this wire right click here now you can able to see segment diameter over here from here you can see the segment diameter of that wire just here you can see diameter 0 0.0866 inches the means 
here one indicates only one wire is routed and here this diameter shows 0.086 inches having diameter okay because every wire has a diameter and now one main question is uh, arising in your mind that is um, if a wire is of having different diameters because diff for different wire type TXL, GXL, uh, GPTM whatever the wire type is there different according to insulation different diameter are there so in this uh, database we have to create the wires because wire section is also here W ascending in ascending order we have to find that one yeah here the wire group is there click on this here you can see different wires are there just like FLRAY dash A this wire is there and next uh, yeah this TXL wire is available in this database so this TXL wire is there okay so in this like we have to make the wire and then we have to mention the diameter of that wire in that during making that wire okay so that we will see in upcoming videos playlist okay how to create wire how according different types of wire DXL, DXL, GPTM whatever the wires are there uh, how to define give the color of that wires and next how to we also see in this video to today how to check the segment diameter of the wire okay if you again route this wire second uh, in the second cavity of the first table and the second table like this and then if you click on the uh, this uh, wire segment right click and segment diameter you can see the diameter is in, it goes on increasing now it's a 0 0.1732 and here it is showing 1 and 2 means 2 conductor are there okay so uh, this means that uh, whatever the wire you are going to route from this from location to to location uh, the every wire diameter is calculated here so this is called as segment diameter and we can calculate the bundle diameter and cable diameter of the bundle okay so and next so we will see in the next videos this is only introduction video we can say or just a summary and we can say the what the content I am going to deliver, deliver in this playlist uh, I am just uh, giving that uh, content to you so we will learn in the next videos how to get this connector this with uh, side view in the component and then how to give this additional parameter to this uh, connector because we have to create this attribute also ok and if next uh, we will see this type this table type different table types are available here you can customize that table also right and you can reset the table also okay so how to do that uh, that one we'll see in the upcoming videos and now yeah here yeah only this one is there how much data you want to present in this table you can edit you can add the uh, columns and rows in this tables as required and nextly what the type of representation you want to show here just like for top view side view from from front view you want to show here you can you can make the symbol in this and you can make the component new use here okay and just like uh, connector have different parts wave lock is there uh, sometime uh, what you can say HST are used here so how to show this uh, heat shrink on the uh, wire how to show braiding how to create that all the tape how to create table or how to create the tapes okay and how to fill all this revision in this drawing and nextly that is yeah as you can has what you can say all our previously made template over here how to edit this template and how to fill the information after updating these templates okay so all these things we are going to cover in this uh, video playlist okay and now uh, I just want to request you uh, please subscribe my channel because uh, I am making the different different design skill video which will be helpful to your job skills okay so thank you very much friend for watching this video and kindly subscribe to the channel